hello good morning guys so today is something a little bit different um, I just woke up and had my cup of tea and I boot up my PC and I saw there's an update available on Nvidia and then I just installed it you know it's fresh of the day and all that stuff and I got a this message on my thing Just so you can, you guys can see. I'll zoom in. So I got this message on the uh, system, and then I was like, "Oh my god!" I couldn't even open my GeForce. I couldn't do anything to it. it. Just keep on crashing and giving me this code. And I went around, look around, how to fix it. There's some old um, post available, but so one way of fixing it uh, you might able to do might able to yes is just install everything and then reinstall the drive could fix it but there's another way of doing it by a clean state sort of thing it will just clean up everything for you behalf of you and this is how you do it kind of thing so first um go to nvidia this page here I sort of downloaded it from straight from here just uh, find the current GeForce that you are in so mine right now is uh, 30 series and 3070 it's a Windows 10 English I mean you can go UK or US whichever it doesn't matter you know you can go there and then hit search And then you'll give you um, you're looking for the top two literally uh, one with the game drive the other one just a studio drive um, there's not much of a difference it's just one will come with enable with games uh, like you can optimize your games and things like that more become a streamer type sort of thing other one for like based on studios like editing and, and stuff like that I always download the uh, WHQL version just download that one and then once you download it um, once it's done it'll be like um, like if I just click on it yeah it'll be like uh, almost 600 to 700 megabytes it might take a while depends on you for me it took only five minutes because my internet speeds fast so once you download it, it'll be here in your download file. Just go to your download file. Don't just open it straight away. Run it through admin always because you don't know what kind of thing. I mean, yes, everything is safe in NVIDIA, but you don't know. So you will always run any file you open through admin. Once you're done with the admin, it's give you this pop-up message. And then it gives you this message here. You can choose any any driver you want it to be installed. Just hit install with the OK with the C drive. You don't need to go anywhere. Keep your D drive or F drive to games and other things. So you press OK, and it will go through this load up process. Once it complete, uh, it will give you another pop up. Pop up, pop up. Where's my pop up? Oh, pop up has arrived on a different one. So once you go through here, uh, the first thing it will tell you um, would you like to download the additional GeForce experience and the driver both? Of course, you do. You don't want to download only one, you, you want to download both. So each time when there's an update, you can update it, especially good for the gamers so you can keep up with everything so you press agree and continue here if you download express they go they don't give you the option to do clean slate like clean everything and re-download it they don't give you their option so I would recommend you to hit custom don't worry there's no nothing wrong with it if you hit custom okay I'm on custom area and then 
hit next from there here it will tell you um, what you're downloading and just underneath here I know you can't read it but it says performance a clean installation pretty much clean state it will wipe everything out and then download this freely you hit you click it and you hit next and install it all the way through uh, it will just do the normal installation like your screen will go black and white black you know black and then back on black back on and if you have things like my setup like dual setup one screen might go black when you you know restart it will be don't worry it's perfectly normal uh, nothing wrong with it um, I already done this I don't need to do this I'm only doing it just for you guys um, so I'm gonna just um, back up get out of here and cancel so now when I'm opening GeForce it does not come with the error message it just goes straight to it That was weird, didn't see that before. But it just goes straight away. Now it's just all fine, all good. The driver is up to date. Let's see, there's no any more drivers available, it's up to date. So that's it guys, that's how we fix this silly ass bug that you guys normally get. So this is how we fix this bug. Why can't you just, you know, I, all I want to do is just zoom in, okay? So, if you want to fix that bug, go and do that. I'll put the link down below for you guys to fix, and that's it. All good. Thank you for watching, guys. It'd be great if you just subscribe to me, and I can release more videos like this in the future. Thank you so much. Take care. Have a nice day. Or have a good morning for some.